We're going to turn now to the latest trouble for Chris Brown. Prosecutors are going to court in L.A. today to claim that Brown violated his probation after his 2009 attack on Rihanna. They say he skipped out on community service, and ABC's Matt Gutman is here with that story. Hey, Matt. Hey, good morning, George. In fact, one of the allegations that is, is that he didn't complete a single hour of community labor in his home district of Virginia, and that he wasn't even in the state on some of the days he was supposed to be picking up trash. The L.A. district attorney now wants him to redo hundreds of hours of community service, this time in L.A. Chris Brown, the bad boy crooner of Please Don't Judge Me, may not get his wish this morning. Brown is slated to appear before a Los Angeles judge today. After new allegations, the singer didn't do over 1,400 hours of community-focused labor he was ordered to perform in 2009, part of his sentence for pleading guilty to assaulting his then and current girlfriend, Rihanna. The defendant, Chris Brown, must not harass, strike, threaten. At assault, the time, the DA says Richmond, Virginia's police chief agreed to supervise Brown doing tasks like cleaning up trash and removing graffiti. Instead, the DA now says its investigation revealed no credible, competent, or verifiable evidence that he did any of the work, saying the police department at best kept, quote, sloppy documentation and at worst provided fraudulent reporting. And if, in fact, he didn't do these hours, then the judge is going to give him a choice. Either do it here in Los Angeles County so it can be verified or simply go to jail. Among the allegations that on days Brown was supposed to be doing labor, it wasn't even enrichment. The DA says one day the singer was on a private jet headed for Cancun, where the singer reportedly posted these photos on his blog. Brown's attorney, Mark Garagos, denies those allegations, saying Brown didn't violate anything, was not on a plane to Cancun, and that he was always doing his work. In a lengthy court motion, the DA also cites several run-ins Brown has had since going on parole, including allegations of a recent fight with singer Frank Ocean and accusations he swiped a cell phone from a Miami club goer last year, allegations which Garagos also denies. Now, the Richmond police couldn't be reached for a comment. Now, if the judge, judge finds that Chris Brown broke his probation, it is possible he could force him to serve all those hours in jail.